Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome back to the RDI campaign. In the previous few episodes we unfortunately had war declared on us by the Bruchi and they assaulted me at Yadda and we lost the battle here and they raided Yadda actually. I thought they would take it but they didn't, they raided it. And since then we've come back with a big strong army called the Raiders. We can actually upgrade them here. Let's see, we're going to go for... Um, melee attack, that'll do. And we'll go for... I think we want authority for you. Let's go for one for authority. And we'll be chasing them down. We can actually get there this turn, I think. No, we can't. We will be going there shortly, though, to try and deal with them. And then I'm probably going to go towards Sajista and try and take Sajista myself. Because it's not a wall settlement. And I think its garrison probably won't be able to hold against this army. So we're going to go on the offensive this turn. And hopefully we can claim that settlement. We have rebels, Latin rebels here. Just can't seem to get rid of these rebels at the moment. Been a real pain in the arse. Don't have any money to recruit anything. I have mercenary Etruscan hoplites, which cost 599 per turn. Probably want to disband them. My money will go down. My fleet is nearby, so they can assist me, of course. Put them there. Get them in that area. So we have our general. We have four members of this fleet, plus one in this fleet, plus a garrison of nine plus two. We might be able to hold against them if they attack. If they don't, I think this army would be wise to go over there and sort them out, which I think we will do. Rome has actually taken Rome back as well from the Etruscan League. Interesting development there. So the Etruscans are not on Italian soil anymore. And of course, Epirus has Brundisium, and it looks like Syracuse has Cosentia. So, plenty of things happening around the Mediterranean. But I think this turn, I am going to click Enter. Oop, bankruptcy, that's fine. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully we can get through unscathed and build and try and take on our enemies. Armenia, Brucci. Okay, here we go. Are they going to attack me? Something's happening, but the camera's all the way down here. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's better. They've retreated, so we're going to chase them, and hopefully we can take them on. Wouldn't mind taking Sagista. I can't even say it. Sagestica. I keep calling it Sagista. I don't know why. Sagestica. We are bankrupt. We can't recruit anybody, unfortunately. That's okay though. Faction destroyed. Masagetai. Masagetai are destroyed. Right. Warriors all. Warriors all. We have a decent army. We have ballista. We have war dogs. This army is what's costing me my my income at the moment because of all the mercenaries. I'm going to disband them as soon as I take Sergistica. Um. Ready for battle. Try and creep closer. I want to try and see what they have without going too far. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to go all the way, I think. There we go, that's better. 13 plus 7 and 11. There are quite a lot of men, actually. I'm just going to stay there for now, I think. I've got no movement um, points anyway. Oh, God, we have all of these things. My public order... I think I have rebels over here, but looks of things. Oopsie. <laughs> Anyway, we're going to go back over to Italy where things are slightly kinder towards us at the moment. This rebel army has to be dealt with. There's loads and loads of men now. I think we need to bring this army around. My, my fear is that Intsaburez will claim Velathri when I'm moving out, so I'm going to have to be a bit, bit wary of them. If I attack here, I'm hoping that my armies will reinforce and they will do so what we got reinforcing we have some cavalry for my general ballista and some decent units and the garrison i think we can probably take these on so i shall see you all on the battlefield okay guys welcome to the battlefield we're going to start things off straight away it's a horrible rainy day here but look at the state of them 
Not a single decent warrior among them. My general gives his speech. And children. Now they face our wrath. Not much of a speech, to be honest. <laughs> oh well. My reinforcements are making their way to the battlefield, and they are coming behind us, which is good. Grab all of them. We're going to bring them to the top of this mountain to begin with. Seems like a sound strategy. My general can probably hide here. I don't know where they are. Hang on. There they are. They're over there. That's where they're coming in by. I need to get the ballista on them as quickly as possible. Go to let them get into position first on this hill. I can only see a few units. That's the cavalry and swordsmen that have come first. I don't know if there's any down here. We're going to remain hidden and hope that they won't ambush me there. Range of my ballista. We wouldn't be too far off the noble cavalry, so what we're going to do with the ballista is put them about there. Less for them to travel should make it a bit easier. And then I'm going to try and group up these units as best as I can. So what do we have? We have Lyrian Hoplites or Hoplites. They're going to go by here. Then we have some missile troops. These four are all put together as well. And they're all coming from, from actually back here. So we have our garrison as well. They're going to go on the right flank. All of these tribesmen and the spearmen are all going to be put into one group behind. Oops, that's a bit untidy. That's slightly better. Blister will be in position shortly. Going to bring them a little bit further forward. Try and get a nice organized line. Try and vanquish the rebels as quickly as I can. Get the cavalry on the left flank. What do we have left? My general. We put his own group for him. Some levies. Levies can go by here. Oh, and they're attacking me straight away. Let's go for the skirmishers. Two units of cav to take on their cav. He who wears din. Uh, he who wears dins. <laughs> he who wear. He who dare wins. That's all I want to say. I completely levies. cocked that up then. <laughs> Oh, and the cavalry is doing very well. Didn't expect that, my god. Right, these three gotta get in quickly now. Group block and charge. The AI surprised me by it. Right, bring them forward. Oh, uphill charge isn't good. Blister. You can actually fire now. I'm losing lots of men, my god. Oh my god. They completely ambushed me. I didn't even see this coming. Charge. Big mosh pit. Oh, why can't I use your abilities? That's stupid. Walk right. Second wind. Javelins, get up quickly. Attack. Right click to get that. 70 against 36. Oh my god, pull out. This is a waste. Pull out. Not cost effective at all doing that. Uh, they can chase them do off down there. Hoping that the numbers game will work in my favour. Well, these guys are holding, just about. Illyrian hoplites. Oh my god, I thought I'd pull these guys away. No. Idiots. Idiots, idiots, idiots. Just got a couple of manual shots in for the... for the kills. Boom. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Javelin men. Javelin men ready for the battle. Illyrian. My generals completely chased them off the battlefield. I don't mind that. For the time being at least. Kill, 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 kill. the javelins. These guys are holding. Oh, they're not going to hold much longer though. The cavalry charging in the rear. Get that ballista to get some shots in. 
I think Killer General would be something. Taking the generals, mine's down here. He can now come back up. Okay, we've got a little bit of time to try and work something out by here. Right, here we go. This is what I'm going to do. Turn Skirmish off, get them behind, get these two in the formation by here. All three of these are going to attack the Spearmen simultaneously. We've got no decent abilities. We're actually using our Rapid Advance ability. These two Spears are going to hold up here. And my General's going to come back. Behind them like so. While the Ballista can continue to attack them on his right flank. Try and get some kills. Ooh, that was good. That was very good. Better off leaving them go by their own devices, I think, though. Rather than worrying about me doing it manually. Right, don't chase, don't chase, you silly fools. Get back into the formation. Right, I have some sort of formation going over these guys. These guys are all firing as well. They're all in, well, they're all in range, but many of them are in range. Get automatic fire at will off. Don't want them to waste anything. I'm happy for them to sit there and let the ballista take some shots on them at the moment while my men get into position. This could be a good recovery by here against these rebels. I'll try and kill as many of them as I can. Right, now we're going to put fire at will on. They have skirmishers. General's going to go to the right flank. He's then going to attack, attack the skirmishers. They have some skirmishers left, which we must deal with. Attack there. Get my general on the flank. What's doing? Put them there. Well, and I got some hoplites back. That's good. And the general's waver in. That's good. My men are going to continue to fire upon them. We can now wipe up the skirmishers that are here. And this battle should more or less be over, I think. Tribesmen break formation, these guys can actually turn there, they can charge there. General's going to come in for a charge. Ballista's out of ammunition anyway. Hoplite has got caught up. Turn on the swordsman. Go for the swordsman, it's easier than going for spearmen with cavalry, that's not good. Warcry. Lots of their men are currently routing, which is good. I think that's the battle. There we go. Victory. End the battle there, I think we want to. Yes. Costly victory. I don't mind. <laughs> it's one way of getting rid of rebels. Pyrrhic victory. 146 kills for my general. Didn't do too badly with him. Could have probably brought him back to the main site of the battlefield earlier. I wanted him to chase that cavalry off because if they had a unit of cavalry still there, it would have been quite difficult. Oh, we have a noble death, so it looks like my general is dead anyway. Oh, Brykos, he was a good general as well. Oh, well. At least the rebels are dealt with, that's something. And we're going to kill the captives because that's the kind of guy I am. So we want to go for... Oh, not enough to... Any current bodyguard will be depleted. Epidius. we we'll go for Epidius and we're going to continue with the cavalry. There we are. The Game didn't freeze, that's good. <laughs> this guy now, uh, Antis, can go to Velathri for me. To it, while this guy can now go back into Ariminum. And there we are, guys. I'm going to end this episode here. I've been Dragonheart. Hope you all enjoyed. Until next time, goodbye.